doesn't matter how much skill you have. It doesn't matter how talented you are. If you can't keep people's attention away from scrolling face after face on their TikTok or Instagram, what's the point of having a business? Early on in the mess that we've all had to deal with for the last few years, I got stuck outside of China and couldn't be the CEO on site that I normally was. I got stuck in Bali. I get it. No one's going to give me sympathy, understandably so. Rewind a few years before I started the company. I had worked for a company called Odesk, now known as Upwork. I was doing business development management, helping them set up partnerships with large companies to use their API to help hire and recruit talent for these companies. In that process, I learned about the gig economy. I learned about all the different people that were working as freelancers, building their own companies without the capital requirements that it took in the past to build company, without really needing to create a big marketing effort because they could use platforms like Upwork to find jobs that could sustain their lifestyles. Through that experience, I learned and hired a few staff in India. I went down to India and set up an office to run our sales department. Up until a couple of years ago, Morpho didn't even have a marketing department. It was not till then back now in Bali when I started to meet all of these freelancers that were holed up in Bali, doing different types of jobs, working marketing jobs with a few clients, that I really realized that it was time for us to grow up as a company and start hiring marketing and start hiring more staff on the front end of the business to start to show the world and our potential customers, what substantial size of business we really were, what kind of business we had on the back end, and what kind of support we could offer people looking to manufacture their products. The gig economy was great to us. We grew faster than we ever had. We hired people with all sorts of different talents and skill sets from all over the world, and it was really beneficial to us as we grew. I think now that the gig economy while it's here to stay, mm -hmm. I think we are now entering a new phase that I think should be called the attention economy. Some people have talked about this. I've heard it in the past, but more and more I'm realizing it doesn't matter how much skill you have. It doesn't matter how talented you are. If you can't keep people's attention away from scrolling face after face on their TikTok or Instagram, What's the point of having a business? Now more than ever, you have to create content that sticks. You have to create content that's interesting. You have to create content that not only grabs attention, but keeps it. So our goal as a company in 2023 is to really double down on our media and content and really figure out a way to continue to show the world and anyone potentially that could be working with us what it is that we do and why it is they should pick us to work with us. So if you've been following the videos, you know we've been creating more content, but to keep you in the loop, there'll be much more coming. Peace.